Hey guys, I'm back with your singles, couples, and twin flames. Okay, bottom of the deck, we got flirt. And we got the nine of cups, okay? So all three dynamics, there's something going on here with overindulgence, okay? This could be maybe someone who's in a relationship that's flirting with other people that they're not supposed to. Um, or pretending, you know, to be something they're not in order to get some type of... Um, wish fulfillment okay or you know for the singles this could be that maybe you have um you're pretending to be something you're not in order to obtain something okay or appear a certain way to obtain something okay um flirting is also very significant so this could be a situation where maybe you're flirting with too many people or but we'll dive in okay so for the singles you guys got soulmate okay and um this could be a situation where you're either dating someone new or you have someone on your mind 111 on my on my time um you have someone on your mind that you feel is a soulmate okay and the two cards verifying that is the eight of pentacles and the three of um wands okay so someone here is hard at work while waiting for some type of ship to come in okay maybe you decided to wait on the right one okay uh, your soulmate per se like your real true soulmate okay um so now you're just hard at work building your stability building your finances it could even be your stability within you and you're just waiting you're just waiting for your ships to come in okay um the only message with um the bottom of the deck cards i feel that it could be that maybe you're not flirting with others like you're just like you're literally keeping to yourself and waiting um with the nine of cups though it's like you're pretending to be something you're not in order to get this wish fulfillment so maybe it's that you're pretending to be happy and you're kind of like masking that pain with like your job or your work because you have someone in mind already that you feel is a soulmate okay um for for the couples you guys have codependency okay so this is a dynamic um where it has to do with some type of codependency okay the nine of pentacle the nine of um cups in the bottom could also be a someone who drinks maybe some type of addiction having to do with a drinker okay um and then clarifying the cards we have the sun and the ten of cups side to side okay so this lets me know that this is some type of inner child healing that is preventing you from attaining the ultimate level of um emotional fulfillment and stability okay because this the dynamic that you're in is codependent okay it could be a codependency on finances uh you're you're codependent on someone to provide for you you're codependent on someone to be your partner and, and for you not to be alone you're codependent on someone because you're addicted to them okay and that codependency stems from some type of inner child healing but the side to side is like you don't know whether you're happy if you're emotionally fulfilled fully or not so this is why this card is side to side because the codependency stems from something from your childhood the sun talks about abundance and prosperity it talks about chasing those things that help you grow and it also talks about some type of enlightenment so some type of enlightenment is you know having to do with this codependency okay it's going to be made clear to you okay um also this is why you could be in that nine of cups because you're pretending to be something that you're not you're you know you're pretending to be content with this relationship um but in the end at the end of the day it's like you're undecided if it brings you like emotional fulfillment like the ultimate emotional fulfillment or like even emotional stability in a sense um the sun also talks about um there was one more thing that i was going to bring up with that um not inner child healing we talked about the abundance and 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 the, the enlightenment yeah um yeah like your inner child like chasing those things that help you grow so there's something here with this codependency that has stemmed from something in your childhood you're in this dynamic to like learn a lesson having to do with something that you uh, some type of codependency that you haven't um 
you haven't completed a cycle on okay so this is why you're in that dyna dynamic that you are now okay um for those on a twin flame journey you guys have chemistry okay um you guys have like this push and pull to each other okay well one day it's like i miss them the next day it's like f you like <laughs> i don't want nothing to do with you because there's a lot of chemistry here okay um and it could be um energetic chemistry it could be sexual chemistry it could be some type of push and pull that you guys have okay and someone is undecided about bringing some type of clarity or truth to the situation that having to do with a reunion okay having to do with coming back together or with someone if that's not it then this is some somebody undecided about bringing the truth and clarity to someone having to do with a third party situation okay and this is why the nine of cups is here okay because someone is not being truthful someone is pretending to be something they're not in order to get th their wish fulfillment okay um and and someone's over it could be that someone's also overindulging you know with other people okay because this is a third party card um guys i hope you were able to obtain some type of clarity and i'll see you guys in the next reading take care